Hey guys, what's going on guys? Jake here. Welcome back to another video on Rainbow Six Siege. It's going to be a short, kind of lengthy video. Um, I kind of wanted just to talk about Rank this season, um, why I think it is a nightmare, and um, what steps do I, f or what factors do I feel like kind of are miss nah, how do i say it? like i feel like there's a lot of things that ubisoft could do and i want to just like describe it and as you guys can see i'm silver five right now i think like you guys know that i or you guys, actually i'll actually you know what i'm actually going to link my r6 tracker profile in the description below i'm gonna i'm gonna do that and you guys can actually see that i was a gold player pretty much all the time and then, for some reason, Void Edge... Okay, all with my opinion, Void Edge, I didn't play until the, the end of the season. And then, for for last season... Last season, I didn't play until the end as well. But this season was complete bullshit. And I'm just going to just kind of, like, go over that. And, yeah, so let's get into it. So, um, as you guys can see, I am Silver 5 right now. Um, I have a 9 win... Nine win loss, but I have a 1.0 KD. Now, you might be wondering, well, why are, well, why are you, why are you silver? Like you should, like you should, you should be gold. And in my opinion, um, you're absolutely right. And I think it just comes down to why the rank system is so screwed up. And I want to just, like, go over that a little bit. I made a video a long time, not a long time, like, maybe, like, a month ago, maybe two, um, that was not published to YouTube. This one's going to be published. Um, and I kind of, this that was a rant. But this one is a, this is a calm, calm assessment of the season. So, admittedly, I got, okay, so, admittedly, I was placed into Silver 2, no, so yeah, silver two, and I work and I worked my way up to silver one, but then I lost, but then I went on a complete losing streak in silver. And now keep in mind how bullshit this was. I had five wins, five losses, with a KD of one point one, and I still got silver. Like I, I think, just. It's very BS because I know that I'm that I personally am a gold player, and I think it's very sad to see that like the most recent charm that I have is Shadow Legacy, where I was gold, and it's it's just very annoying. Now, um, I'm gonna use this example. So friend, so me and friend A. This season we're playing. We were we were playing with. Um, two of friend A's friends, and or at least one of friend A's friends. Uh, the other one was kind of on and off. But anyway, we were playing it, and friend and we got ranked silver, right? And let's say friend B, who is friends with friend A, he actually got gold. But here's the thing. He was carried like easily two games solo queuing right you might you might be thinking well that's just solo queue for you and yeah but like f friend b is very how do i say it? it's he's very unexperienced in comparison to me me and friend a so that really is annoying because that really tells me okay so rainbow six siege is just rigged if it's essentially a care it's it's essentially a carry game. It's based on wins and losses. And that's one thing that I really want this is something I really wanted to how do I say it? Like this is something I really want to bring up is that ranked is so screwed up. Not only from silver, not only like the silver to, like the bronze to silver rank it completely, but the entirety of just ranked so i want to go over that so let's start off with ranked let's start with let me start off with my experience with silver and bronze so i actually reached bronze one once no actually twice my bad twice and 
I'm going to tell you guys what I've seen a lot of. Starts with an S. I'll wait. Guess, guess what I'm trying to say. If you guess Smurfs, you're correct. I got, I, I actually encountered into probably 50% of, not even 50, like 75% of Smurfs during my time in Silver and Bronze. And, the, and I feel like the only reason why I'm down at this rank is because of those smurfs. Because what a lot of people are doing, and Ubisoft, if you're listening to this, this is your game right now. Ubisoft, well, not Ubisoft. These players are exploring the game. They're getting a count. So, so okay, let's, let's use, um, let's say that, um... Tim, well, let's, let, let's use Timothy here. So, Timothy. Let's say Timothy here has a plat... Well, let's say that P Timothy right here played ranked this season and got diamond. But he doesn't want to lose his diamond. Right? So, what does he do? Does he play unranked? No. Does he play casual? No. He creates a brand new Xbox account. I'm using this because I'm playing on Xbox right now, as you guys, as you guys can tell. He makes a new Xbox account. Levels it up to level 50 or so. Gets ranked in, like, silver. Or, or as, low, as low as he can get. And he climbs with that account through through bronze through silver through golds through plats all the way back up to diamond and i think it's just really shitty of a little bit if like you're like i think it's really shitty because that essentially is cheating in a sense because you are exploiting the game for your personal gain on that account. Um, I don't know if this is really... I don't know if this is very prevalent in PC. Please let me know if it is. But personally, I've encountered every single freaking Smurf under the sun in Silver. And also, Silvers have the dumbest minds as well. So, like, on top of that... So, let me just put this in perspective. I would be playing a game... Against a team. My teammates. Will act like they have not. That that uh, that they just got Rainbow Six Siege yesterday. And. The. Enemy team. Will play like they're in golds. Like, gold one tier. Or gold one rank, my bad. You see what I'm trying to get? Like, this season is just screwed up. And I don't even know if this is just silver rank in general. But I feel like it's more prevalent what Smurfs are doing. So that's my thoughts on it. And trust me, I've tried looking for group posts. But guess what I've actually come out, come out to find? I found that, uh, I found that people, how do I say this? People DOS in Rainbow Six Siege. It's more pre, like the hack, the hack, the cheating problem in Rainbow Six Siege right now, at least in console a little bit, seems to be increasing. I don't know if that's just me, or if that's just the system, or if that's just Ubisoft being like, haha, cheers, give me money, haha. But, like, I think in my, I think during my, I think every single time I'm in a looking for group post, or that I've played with a looking for group, um, group, I've had all of them leave after one loss, or everyone gets lost.
And that's just it. Like, I, 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 I don't know what else to say here. Other than, like, am I disappointed in my rank this season? Yes. Do I think there was something I could do more? Yes. But at the same time, I think there are serious things that need to happen at Ubisoft. Which leads me to my next thing. Ranked needs an overhaul. And I know that's very crazy to sound, or that's a, that's a very crazy thing to say. But hear me out. When we look at other games, such as maybe Call of Duty or, um, what's a good example of this? Like Overwatch. They have systems that reward players based on how they do in a match. For instance, like if I am a, if I play support every single time when I'm unranked, I will get a higher rank than if I was pl than if I play as a hard reacher or a fragger. And I'm just gonna be straight up, like look at my KD right now. KD 1.1. Theoretically speaking, if the if, if I was ranked based on my KD right now, I would probably be in gold two. Or gold in the gold three right now, actually. Gold three. At least. Or at least at least silver one. But it's so screwed up as the the whole system determines you on did you win or how many times did you win how many times did you lose and just overall like how many people did you kill before you died like it, it's just like the whole thing like like, if I was being honest, they need, like, I don't, to be honest, I'm going to be completely honest, I don't think the KD actually does anything in ranked, just to be completely honest. And I know it's really shitty to say, but I think that's true. Now, what factors would I like to see for ranked? Well, for one, I would like to see them, like, take into consideration, like, Taking to like consideration what um like I want them to like take into take into consideration like cross match your KD with your operator to determine like why you have that KD. That's my opinion. I think another thing that they should add is actually not part of the whole rank system all together is two separate ranked pools and i know this has been a big issue not a big issue but a huge thing that a lot of people were asking for and trust me i actually want it as well and that is for them to make two pools solo queue ranks and regular ranked like squad ranked and you can only play solo queue if you're solo like I am right now. And if and if you have more people in your lobby, you cannot play regular ranked. Like you can't play regular ranked with solo queue people. You can't play solo queue. You can't play um you can't play solo queue with ranked players. Like with like people who are playing regular ranked, it just doesn't work like that. Like I feel like that is something that needs to be ha that needs to happen if console siege is going to survive as a ranked community. Now, I'm not gonna close things off here just because I've been talking for a while about it. I just want to say this: Do I feel disappointed in myself? Yes, I do. But. The main thing is, is that rank does not matter. And I know that for a fact. Rank does not matter. It just depends. All it is, is just the system determining a false rank for you, depending, dependent on did you win or did you lose. That is all this is right now. But, like, understand this as a viewer looking inside. Or, look, a, a, a viewer looking at me... 
I've had gold for Shadow Legacy and Steel Wave, and then I and then the silver silver and Neo Dawn brought me down, and now this happens. Like, understand how big of a disappointment that is, and that's why, like, I feel like Rainbow Six Siege needs to change their rank system for the better. And I think this is a very pre prevalent thing, like, on console. Like, for I think for, like, PC, it's easier because you guys can record it. You guys can record for a lengthy amount of time during a match. But like for console, it's very difficult to record something and then send it to Rainbow Six and they will never get banned. But that's just my opinion, guys. Thank you guys. If you guys made it this far, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry for this rant, but it's something I want to do because I want to be transparent with you guys about my rank. And I didn't want to ignore it. And I'm actually kind of disappointed with Ubisoft for not, with like this, sh like showing me if anything, me being placed down to silver has shown me so much BS that, like, Smurfs can get away with. And, like, people can get away with on console. But, yeah, that's just my rant. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And hopefully, I'll do a video soon about something else. I don't know Rainbow Six, I don't know if that's Rainbow Six, re Rainbow Six related, Far Cry New Dawn related, um, Lego Marvel Super Heroes, um related but i don't know i uh, thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out oh and also let me also let me know guys if you guys have experienced um bs during the season crimson uh crimson heist i'll see you guys in the next video